one of the most common questions I get today from students are, Jay, how in the world are you finding deals? How's everybody else finding deals? Because like there's no inventory, there's nothing in the multiple listing service. Well, guess what? There's plenty of deals out there as long as you are consistently marketing and you know how to find them. Um, and then after that, who knows? I might even tell you about my house that Carol Joy and I and the team here are closing on tomorrow on Pearson Circle, $500,000 after repaired value, buying it for $200,000. Sounds like that's got a little bit of spread, right? Uh, we're closing on that tomorrow. And uh, so anyway, yeah, we're talking real deals. I mean, here at the Private Money Academy, we're not talking fluff. We're not talking theory. We're not talking, I think this might work. We're talking about what's actually working right here in this market. All right, let's talk deals, folks. Let's talk deals. We're going to start with Stu and Harriet Baldwin up in New York. And um, they are Platinum and Mastermind members. And I see Harriet is showing, oh, my word. This is the deal we're going to talk about. Did you actually, did you actually buy that? We bought this. <laughs> I'll let you explain it. And then I have an after picture that will help you understand why we bought it. Okay. So before you start, let me remind everybody, Stu and Harriet. So when we started working together, I mean, they've been in the PMA forever. They're Platinum and Mastermind. They, they came to me and my team with already a hundred houses in their portfolio. And they just wanted a few more million dollars in private money. But this is these this couple's very seasoned real estate investors. So I want you all to listen closely. I have no idea what they're going to tell, but I know it's going to be the truth. I want you to listen very closely to their story. And I want you as as you are learning lessons and picking up things, I want you to type it in the chat as to what your takeaways are. All right, Stu and Harriet, I'm going to be quiet and let you all tell it. Thank you, Jay. Nice to uh, have this opportunity to share. Uh, I've been in one form or another real estate for about 40 years, uh, mortgage broker, mortgage banker, real estate developer, now real estate investor primarily. Harriet's been working with me for about 15 years. Uh, this is an interesting deal. Uh, we live in a low cost area of upstate New York. Uh, it's called Elmira. We talked, they were asking 25 grand for uh, what is a larger single family house in the front. We haven't shown you that picture yet. We only have a good after of that one at the moment. And a, a two family house in the back, which Harriet showed you the deplorable condition. You can see that was in. why they were thinking about tearing it down. Uh, so we negotiated down to 20,000. And then there was another wrinkle in the deal uh, that two family in the back, because it had also been vacant for 15 years, had long ago lost its ability to be a two family house legally. So we had to go to zoning to get permission. So we made our offer contingent on zoning approval. Uh, so we renovated both properties. Yeah, we'll show you this now the, the after for the back property. This is the after. Yeah, and that's the small house at the back. And then Harriet will show you the main house in the front. This is the front house. We got both of these for $20,000. Now, we did have to spend a bunch on them, but Stu will give you those details. So the re all in the rehab costs were about 110. So we bought it for 20. We spent 110. Uh, we just got the appraisal from the bank yesterday at 232000 So other than a few bucks of carry cost, that's a nice home run, again, for our neck of the woods, which is a low-cost area. And remember, it looks whoops, like this. Oh. So banks were going to laugh at us if we were trying to use any kind of traditional financing. So without Jay and his private money program, Unless you had the money in your pocket, not just the 20 grand to buy it, but the, what was it, 110 of rehab costs, oops, nothing. So, so uh, real quick questions to inherit, um, and I'll let you pick up where you left off. 
So you bought the whole property with with two houses on it for twenty grand. Yes, correct. So you're so what's the value now? Would you say? So yep, we just got the appraisal yesterday done by the bank. Two hundred thirty-two thousand. Sounds like over a hundred thousand dollars swing to me. Yep. 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 And the monthly rental should be about. It'll be anywhere between three and four thousand a month. So once we refinance, uh, given that interest rates, regular bank type interest rates are so low, uh, it'll cash flow nicely. Uh, and that's a good area. A, a fantastic case study there, Stu and Harriet. What's your recommendation to all the PMA members, Private Money Academy members? Uh, what should they do? What's the next step they should do to enjoy the kind of experience that you are and have? It should come to the live event. <laughs> yeah, we were we were in the same boat that uh, the people listening in from uh, Private Money Academy are at the moment. We literally were on the January 2020 private money call like this. We decided to sign up for the February 2020 live event, not even obviously knowing at that point what COVID was going to do to everybody's lives, but knowing that we could always use some additional capital. And so we came to the live event. We availed ourselves of the opportunities that Jay will make available to you. Uh, and here's the bottom line, folks. Because of what Jay did for us, uh, directly correlating, we have raised a million four of additional capital from people that listened to the webinar that Jay put together for us and would be willing to put together for those of you that sign up for his guidance and follow instructions. So if you want to raise a lot of money, and again, we're not in New York City, we're not in Atlanta, we're not in Chicago. This is a tiny little area of upstate New York, but we were still able to use Jay's tools to raise actually a little over a million four so far. And some and, of those people will uh, be giving us more. And it's just not the money directly from the webinar. We had been pretty stagnated in terms of growth for two to three years before we came to the live event. And we have gone from 100 houses to 150 in the last two years. Units. Units. That's no, that's awesome. Units is 180. That's awesome. That's awesome. Y'all, let's give Stu and Harriet a great big golf clap right there for sharing the case study and the story. That's it, folks. Real deals going on. Yes, Stu? I know. Just thank you, Jay, and we'll see you next month. All right. You got it.